important to remember those who've gone before us and who've paid that ultimate sacrifice because it's a risk that we all face. And the role and the work that we do is incredibly important. It's incredibly important to securing the freedoms of the people that we serve, um, protecting their rights, protecting their freedoms, and, and protecting them. When I met Bill, he was a little bit older for the group that we were in, and he kind of came across as kind of a father figure, which for someone that had just lost his father about a year ago, it was really kind of nice to have that kind of person available. Uh, so in that respect, you know, be, be, Bill being a little older was, was really a benefit for those of us that were 22 years old and getting into law enforcement for the first time. Bill had a unique sense of humor, but at the same time, when there was a job to be done, that's what needed to be done. He, he was really good to work with. He would help you out when he needed it. Um, he would work you in a, a work out the situation so that you would learn what was going on and you would learn from your mistakes. And that was a benefit. One of the things that was done after Bill had died was there was a portrait that was made of him. It reflected, you know, what I remember of Bill, kind of a, an English jaw, um, bigger, bigger chin and English jaw. But most importantly, it reflected a light in his eyes. Um, and and uh, when I have, whenever I see that picture, that's what I see is the brightness in his eyes. Um, that's the Bill that I remember. Bill was the type of individual that you wanted on your shift. You wanted to work with um, because you knew he could he could be counted on. And. For his, his personal family, it was a huge loss that could never be replaced. For his law enforcement family here, it was a great loss. And even up until the time I left, we still were trying to find a way to replace men like Bill Truesdale.